Hi everybody! Happy Halloween! It's so fun to dress up, isn't it? I'm such a girl. <laughs> I'm here uh, just to kind of have fun with you guys and show you a little bit of my costume ideas from yesterday and today. Um, some similarities and some differences. I'm going to post all the pictures at the end, so hang with me. Um, it's a, a little bit of the face of the day, but extreme because, you know, we're doing extreme stuff for Halloween, but I wanted to kind of um, touch base with you guys and put it back a little bit because I have ears. I have kitty cat ears and I have to bling it up with a headband too. So um, oh, I'm going to put it back just a little bit more. Maybe you guys can see better. There we go. Um, today uh, is Halloween and um, today I'm dressed up as none other than a not just a kitten, but a sex kitten. It's so fun to be different. So um, I'm all blonded out today. And yes, it's a wig. Um, I got it at the Spirit Halloween store, but I'm loving this wig. It's probably the most expensive thing I got uh, for my costume ideas. And everything else was Goodwill or some cheap store. This one, uh, the necklace and the earrings. I got at uh, Charming Charlie and they were like $15. So, you know, I, it really, I got a diamond necklace or sorry, bracelet from Charming Charlie for 90 or no Goodwill for 99 cents. The gloves from Goodwill for like three bucks. And, um, I got this gorgeous beaded gown from cache. It's a halter top fitted beaded gown. It was at Goodwill in the costume section for like $15. So, my number one thing is, boy, if you want to put together a good costume and not one of those cheap, flimsy material cutout things for 50 or 60 or $70 at a Halloween store, go to Goodwill and piece your costume together. So that's what I did. Um, I wanted to, um, first of all, uh, I'm going to show some pictures. Last night I was, well, my idea was to be uh, Anna Nicole Smith because I'm a curvy girl and back when she was a curvier girl... So I thought it worked well and it came with, you know, I did the, this, it started with the cachet gown and, um, and then I got the wig and I was thinking old Hollywood glamour, but the more I put it together, the more I realized, Oh, that's a little Anna Nicole going on there. <laughs> so I had fun with that with the gown last night. Now the makeup is a little different today. Uh, last night and I'll, I'll post pictures. Um, I had blue eyeshadow because she wore a lot of blue there with her reds and she went all out and um, it looked actually really cool. I had a lot of compliments. Um, tonight I, or today I'm doing black sparkly eyeshadows and I'm using lashes uh, that I also got from Spirit Store, Spirit Halloween Store that has actually um, like tinsel in it. It's sparkly lashes so, um, you know, adding to the bling. But I wanted to touch upon one thing. I'm not a red lipstick wearer, and I wanted something that was going to last all night, um, but not feel crappy and drying too much. And I have to tell you, I am really impressed with this. It's Wet n Wild Mega Last, and I got it in um, red, to, oh, read my hand. Um, there we go. Very classic red. Very classic red. And um, I did put gloss over it, so that means that we'll kind of it will transfer now that I put gloss on it. But this does dry and stays on. So um, if you don't mind that sensation, you can put gloss over it, but or you can just have it plain and it stays. And I, I mean, it's it's so creamy and smooth, uh, and it, the precise application. I mean, I did use a lip pencil to line first. But you don't have to. This one's got a nice, precise, I'll show you, tip on it. Um, and it does a really, really good job. This is a classic red. Um, not too orange, not too blue, just right there in the middle. And um, if I wasn't a blonde, it probably wouldn't work with my skin tone. But since I'm being a blonde today... Uh, and of course I darkened up my eyebrows. I did change the shape of my brows slightly and, and got them up a little higher, which I actually like. I might even try that tip uh, when I'm doing my own. 
uh, but I was trying to do follow a suit of Marilyn Monroe and Nicole, that kind of uh, era. So anyway, I just was having fun, and I thought I'd share with you guys. Um, I'll, I'll see if I can stand up and show you a little bit. I'm just wearing my um, black uh, faux leather leggings, a belt. I'm borrowing my daughter's um, tail and ears. I also got this headband at Charming Charlie, and that was on sale, I think. It was like uber cheap, um, and I thought it was really cute. And then I, the, the outfit that my daughter, the cat outfit, also came with a collar with a bell, but it was too much here, and I wanted to wear this again. So I put it on my boot. So I'm going to stand up and see if you can see it just a little bit, but I will post pictures. And then I would like very much to hear about your costume ideas, because it is fun to dress up. So here's the belt. Here's my tail. Meow. Meow. And then my boot, if I can get it up here, has the jingle bells. So it's going to be fun because I have another dance tonight. And since I'm all about the boobies, I, I really amped them up last night because I was doing the Anna Nicole thing initially. And then since my boyfriend was uh, in a baseball uniform, we thought Joe DiMaggio and the people thought I was Marilyn Monroe, which, you know, I'll take it. <laughs> but it was all oofing up the boobs quite a bit. And But anyway, I just threw my animal print um, White House Black Market sweater over it because it's going to be, it's a cold and rainy and crappy. So anyway, ladies, I just wanted to uh, share my Halloween ideas and I would really love to see or hear what you're dressing up as. And if you're not, do it for fun. Even answer the door in your costume if you're not going anywhere. But um, I have another dance to go to tonight. My feet are killing me from last night, but it is so much fun to see the creative outfits that um, grown up adults putting together. Uh, before I go, last minute thing, uh, on my gown, um, it was cold. I didn't have a coat. My daughter let me borrow this faux fur cape and it's gorgeous. She got it for her birthday because you know the four, but this is so 40s, 50s, you know, with the pads and everything. I was like, oh, yeah. oh happy birthday. Oh, please. <laughs> Anyway, that's it, guys. Have a fun and safe Halloween, and I will see you next time, and maybe we'll be blonde. It's kind of hit. It's kind of fun. I'll see you guys.